In this video, we're going to go over how to program an RE219 Resolution Products Flood and Temperature Sensor. First, access your installer toolbox and enter your installer code. Select System Configuration and scroll to the first Unused Sensor Zone. We'll be using three different zones to program the RE219. First, for the flood zone, for the sensor type, select 24-hour auxiliary alarm. Equipment type should be water, and then choose existing flood temperature sensor. Press shift and learn and tamper the sensor to learn in the serial number. Select loop 2, and add a voice descriptor. Finally, select the desired chime. Next, we'll do the freeze sensor zone. Again, select 24-hour auxiliary alarm, then select freeze for the equipment type. Select existing flood temperature sensor. And for the serial number, tamper the sensor again by removing its cover. The same serial number will populate. This time, for the freeze zone, you'll select loop 3 and add your voice descriptor and chime level as desired. And finally, we'll program in the heat sensor zone. Select 24-hour auxiliary alarm and select temperature. Choose existing flood temperature sensor. And once again, shift and learn and tamper the sensor to populate the same serial number. This time, for the heat sensor zone, we're going to leave it at loop 1. Add your voice descriptor and change the chime. When done, exit saving changes. This is Jason with Surety DIY. Thanks for watching.